guys i'm gonna quickly show you how to test mosfets mosfet got three legs in between and on the right hand side right hand side is got gates on the left hand side is got is, is called source and then on the top top is the metallic side it's called drain now put it on the table and then change your much meter setting to the diode sign then grab the negative lead put it on the source which is the left hand side of the mosfet put the negative lead from the much meter on the left yeah remember negative is a left hand put it on the left hand and then the positive lead from your much meter connect it to the right hand side for your most uh, called gates for three four seconds one two three four seconds then remove the positive and then connect the positive lead now to the metallic side which is the drain you see you react the mosfet will react like a, a is a capacitor so once you see is reacting like capacitor that means it's working but to make sure that because it's a kind of it's a switch so to make sure it's playing the role of switch, hold, hold the two leads. Hold them on the source and on the drain. Hold them like that. And then use your finger. Use one of your finger to touch the gates and the source of the MOSFET. So you need to connect it with one of your finger. So when I connect both, I see that the multimet show that is going off. That means there's no movement anymore. That means it's turned off the MOSFET. So if I release it, you see it get back to the capacitor again. It, it start counting the uh, the volt. Now if I put it back again once more, my finger connect to the gates which is the right hand side of the MOSFET to the left which is the source of the MOSFET you see that means I'm short cutting it so if I connect both you see the multimeter showing no sign that means I've disconnected it or I turn it off so I turn off the MOSFET that means the MOSFET is good it's working if I remove my finger it starts working again right now this is the example of how to know the mosfet is working so this mosfet is working you can see it is working now i'll leave it on the side now i'll put in the test another one so this one is here so i'll take another mosfet and then do the same scenario again so this is the second mosfet the first one I left it here. This is the second one. Now I put it on the table. So the same way, on the left hand side, I need to put my multimeter negative lead. Negative. Remember the word. Negative made left hand. So on the left hand side, connect it to the negative legs of the MOSFET. Now with your right hand side put the positive lead of your multimeter connect to the gate for two three seconds one one two three or four seconds then remove it if you connect it now to the metallic side which is the drain of the mosfet you see the multimeter showing continuity. Now, it's showing that there's something happening there. We don't know yet. Now, hold both together like we did the first one. Hold the, the negative lead, which is the source, 
and they drain together like we did on the second one on the first one sorry so if you hold both together if you hold both together now you use one of your finger to shortcut or to connect together or to link the right hand side legs of the muscle to the negative hand side or to the left hand side which is the gate connect to the source now let's do the same thing so when i touch them together like the first one is supposed to disconnect or supposed to turn off the MOSFET so we, we notice on this case that nothing is happening nothing at all so you can see just keep beeping 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 and some multimeter you not beep it just gonna stay silent or show one one um uh, something on the display so if you see this way you remove my finger sorry i got it disconnected let me put it back so if i connect the negative to the to the source and then the positive or the multimeter to the drain which is the metallic one i hold them together And then I use my finger to shortcut in it or to turn off or to turn on to use the switch. If I do it, nothing is happening. Nothing is happening. So that means, in conclusion, this MOSFET is dead. So this is how you need to know in the amateur way the MOSFET is working or not working. Thank you so much. Thank you for watching my tutorial and I hope that will help um, amateur or people who want to learn how to measure most for themselves thank you so much guys bye bye